Hi guys, welcome back to another vlog. My hair has been in this for a little bit of time. It's cool now, so I should be taking my hair out actually. Maybe I'll start doing that while... Yeah, what time is it? I don't know, I'm in the middle of doing my makeup. Anyways, just got back from LA a few hours ago. I've been unpacking, doing packages, fixing my house a little bit. I have a birthday party tonight, so I'm gonna go there, we're going to lounge, it's gonna be fun. Uh, most people I actually don't know here. I just have like one friend going. I came home to a box from Princess Polly. Um, so thank you to Princess Polly for sponsoring this video. And I'm not kidding. This might be my best haul from Princess Polly yet. And that's really saying something because I am such a fan of Princess Polly. I have this bodysuit that I think is like to die for. It is so cute. And what I like about it is it's super lightweight. So honestly, I might wear this tomorrow. I'm going to the movies. I'm gonna go see Elvis again. Um, but I love this. Another dress that I can consider wearing tonight, but I just felt like it didn't really make sense for the theme. Anyways, it's very similar to the dress that I had last year that I wore my birthday that I loved. It's great with a black dress in the summer because it doesn't show sweat. Also, this is super lightweight. So it's like, this material honestly is the best thing to wear in the summer. So if you need an outfit, a cute dress for like a night out, I would go with this. It's just perfect. And then it has this cute little like floral detailing. Love. I also got this dress because I live in dresses in the summer. There's nothing else to wear. I love this cut. I have many from Princess Polly in this cut. I have this one in cherries as well. The cherry one's also really cute. Um, and it's just this little floral print. It's cute because you can wear it but with sneakers or just like slides during the day or cowboy boots, um, or dress it up and like wear it with like little mini heels. The next thing I got, okay, this top, I really could have worn this tonight too because it's like pink and sparkly. If I had pants that would have fit the vibe, which I don't really think I do, but this just in the summer, it's so cute. I love that it's like a little asymmetrical vibe, a little tube top. Again, really good for the summer when you're out and you're sweating because you live in Texas, it's 105 degrees or wherever you live. Um, this is not going to show sweat, which I love. So again, if I go out tomorrow night, honestly, this is what I will be wearing. It is just so cute. Also got this little like white romper, which I'm always afraid of wearing white in the summer because like chances are I have some residue. Like normally right now I don't have much self tanner on, but I have, even then I have like dibs beauty stuff on my legs like I don't know I just feel like I always get stuff off but for whatever reason this specific like vibe from Princess Polly it's always fine cute and classic like if you're going to meet your boyfriend's family or something because it's a romper again cowboy boots would be really cute heels like this is just honestly like a very sweet classic look I love that oh this is kind of similar to the bodysuit I got but like same but different you know this is like a little sleep set so a little lounge around the house little vibe i'll definitely be wearing this all the time oh oh no 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 um and the tank top is like really cute honestly like i would wear this out and about i know this is like probably supposed to be pajamas but like this is an outfit for me some people call it pajamas i call it an outfit obsessed like this is amazing i don't know when i this is a romper i don't know when i became a romper girly again i'm honestly very picky when it comes to rompers but i just thought that this was so cute and it looks like a dress now this might be the cutest thing i got in the entire haul this dress even just like i had it earlier and i was looking at it like this and i have my slides on i'm like oh my god it even looks cute with slides i got this dress which i also love because it has the little like cross thing here so i find that to be like really flattering again it's just like perfect dainty cute sweet everything i'm looking for in a summer dress i love almost like a wholesome vibe but like you don't really have to be that wholesome the last thing i got so this is a matching set y'all know i love a good matching set so this pink skirt okay you guys are getting the vibe you'll see it in the try on but love right and then picture that with this pink top i mean like this is very cute i'm really into this moment a cute little like night out like ooh, you could i mean you could also like wear wear more casually but i think it's really cute so if y'all want to order anything that i just showed you or just shop princess Polly, you guys can use code kinseyxo for 20 percent off i'm gonna link every single piece down below i wear princess Polly 
all the time, especially in the summer. My favorite season to shop in Princess Polly is summer. I'm telling you guys, you have to get these dresses. They are some of the best. Other amazing thing about Princess Polly is the shipping. So they actually ship from the US. So any orders over $50, you get free three to four day shipping. I make last minute orders on Princess Polly all the time and so do all my friends i'm telling you guys they also offer afterpay and shop pay to all us customers and they are just the best so i will have everything linked down below be sure to go shop we will continue on with the vlog oh i wanted to bring out the camera because one i got new stony clover things i bought these myself look at how cute and then i got the makeup bag amazing because that big pouch i got in new york honestly it's too big for makeup for me but I love the pouches because they're really good to put in like tote bags and you're packing and things like that. Um, I didn't even think I would ever be like a huge Sony Clover person because a lot of the styles are like not really for me. But I love these styles and I love the brand. I think they're really cool and they're genius. I just like love what's happening here. Anyways, Milk Makeup sent me a bunch of makeup over today and I have been using some of it to get ready and I feel like it's way glowier. Like you can't really tell maybe in the camera, but in real life. Um, the hydrogel primer. I use this again. This is a restock for me. I love 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 this primer It's really good especially if you find that you're I'll link all this up below but It's really good especially if you find that your makeup goes maybe like stale You know when you do your makeup in the morning later on in the day it just looks not good anymore That's a good primer for it. I have the little like refresh spray that I used and I loved it I used this concealer for the first time ever so far, I loved it. It was really lightweight and it just kind of gave me more of a glow. Um, I'm really picky with concealers. I normally don't like concealer and I really like this one. Of course, I'm using my Rare Beauty products always. Oh, and then the like bronzer stick. I love this like mini travel size because it gets in more and it doesn't make your skin. Like I find that my bronzer will kind of get all over the place. It's easier to control. Loved this, like obsessed. Sunshine skin tip. Oh, it's a sunscreen, that's cool. Oh, the scent. It's like obviously, you know, because I'm tired, okay? I've just gotten getting back and I'm moving on with my life. I also use some new Laura Mercier um, powders. I use the blush in Infusion, all that sparkles. Just like a really pretty pink color. And then the highlighter that I use, which I really liked, just a powder. I thought it was super pretty. I think that's kind of what's making my makeup look. So hope you guys enjoy. Welcome back to Texas. I'm so happy to be home. I'm here for two weeks. Y'all already here, subscribe. All right, y'all. I am heading out. I need to take the dogs outside and then I'm going out on the town. Not gonna vlog because it's not my birthday party, but here's my little look. I think it's cute. I like the outfit. Okay, that's not gonna happen. Um, this little bag is Balenciaga. It's the best bag, especially for like going out or going to the bars or whatever because it's so small, which is so cute. So Happy Sunday, y'all. We are getting our lives back on track, back together. I just self-tanned. You might see that on uh, my skin's pajamas and showered um, last night. Yesterday, I had like a family day, and then last night, I went to dinner with friends. Here we are. So my, I'm currently doing laundry. I need to bring down more laundry to do. I need to put on new sheets. I need to kind of declutter and hang some of the rest of my clothes. You know what? I think I'm gonna show y'all a little surprise, a little secret, if you will. This stuff will be a super, super limited batch in September, like incredibly limited. Okay, very quickly. Dun 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 dun. And then, ready? Very quickly. Boom, boom. Okay, so that was that. Um, expect that in September. And they're so comfortable. They're so soft. They're perfect. And we really do have like a super limited drop, so y'all are gonna wanna, um, you know, snatch those up. So I'm thinking it might even cook tonight. Maybe I'll do some things. Yeah, we'll see. I'm gonna go put like new sheets on and like get all that going. But it's hard when you're just tan because I feel like I can't do anything. Like I have tanner on my knees now. Like how do I? I don't know. Just ordered Starbucks. This is not my order. I think they just forgot to put milk in or something. So. Gonna have to figure that out, but I've been loving the kale egg bites lately. They're so good. Still, oh, guys, 
I yesterday unboxed my new laptop. I have my coffee, let's see. Like too sugary, whatever. I got a new MacBook. It arrived when I was out of town. This is my unboxing, even though I took it out of the box, but it's much nicer. I haven't like fully set it up yet. Um, and for whatever reason, it's saying that my, I don't know my iPad password, so I can't just like put everything on it, whatever. You don't care about this, um, but I don't have my passwords on here, so I'm still using my other laptop. But guys, like this one, look at this. Like this, it, it was, it's just gross. And what has really been holding on by a thread. Like last week, I was like, it's, it's over with. So I have a new laptop, which I'm really excited about. I'm drinking my coffee. I'm gonna work on like stuff for the podcast, planning for the next few months, doing my, updating my show tracker, currently sending over new um, vlog footage my editor just getting some work done i just ordered some ramen so it's a really good just sunday reset i'm also gonna make my menu for the week of what i want i might try maybe a new recipe or two i also have been saving some recipes that i've seen on tiktok so i want to try out like new things this week i'm getting back into my healthy productive routine i'm doing 6 a.m pilates 7 a.m walk back on that morning routine um, my niece is having a sleepover midweek, like it's gonna be a good time, but I'm just trying to get everything prepped and ready. I'm in the middle of doing laundry, which is gonna take literally all day, and I am so tired, like unbelievably tired. So maybe I'll take a nap. A nap sounds really great. All right, I got spicy edamame, and then just um, like classic ramen. Just woke up from a little nap to my groceries arriving. So here's a little grocery haul for the week. Um, I know that I'm still going out for like events and stuff, so I didn't end up doing a, like a new new recipe, but I am going back to like two that I always go for. Mozzarella cheese, chia seeds, blueberries, chicken, that's a lot of chicken, eggplant, rice, chicken broth, celery juice, almond milk, carrots. Like why do I say what this is when you guys can clearly see? I don't know. Onions, avocados, celery, sweet potatoes, and I needed a new honey um, because mine is bad. So this is our nice little haul. Y'all, it is currently, what is it? It's not even 7 p.m. and I'm getting in bed to finally really read Taylor Jenkins' read new book and reads new book. It's not out yet, it comes out I think in August, but I have an early copy, so I really, I don't know, this past week in LA, I was just so busy that I wasn't reading a ton at once, and I had this theory that you have to read a book in two or three days, or else it just makes the book not good. So that is my plan for tonight. I'm still waiting on the rest of my bedding to dry, and I am honestly just so tired. So I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog, and I will see you in my upcoming week of my life.